If anyone can call a tennis court his home, it's Joaquim Rosgado. A native of Brazil, his parents were both avid tennis players. Their son became one of the world's top juniors and caught the eye of Hurricane tennis coach Dale Lewis. In his 18th year, he was the Brazilian junior champion. He was a South American junior champion. He went to the semifinals of the Orange Bowl International Tournament here. He went to the semifinals of the U.S. Open Junior Championships. And uh, probably the best of all, he was a semifinalist at Wimbledon Juniors, which solidified him at that point as being the number three ranked junior boy in the world. When Rosgado arrived at Miami, he made an immediate impression. One of his teammates was Peter Lehman, now tennis coach at FIU. Just after watching him play the very first time uh, in a practice, I knew that he was uh, the talent that everyone raged about. Joaquin was, uh, was a, a great uh, touch player. He uh, had uh, extreme control uh, of the racket, uh, could perform uh, any shot uh, at any time, uh, could put the ball on the dime. Uh, Joaquin was one such that it, he was actually good enough that uh, he could almost play with uh, most of his opponents. And uh, he used to like to do that uh, uh, in his time on the court. Put him in a boxing vernacular. He was a boxer. He wouldn't knock too many people out, but he would decision them. If I had to take a top six team out on the court tomorrow, Joaquin would be in that six. And there along with Eddie Dibbs and Jaime Fiol, Luis Garcia, Pat Kramer and Rod Mendelstam. That'd be a hell of a team. In the years since he left Miami, Rosgado has stayed close to tennis, playing on the Brazilian Davis Cup team, and he's currently ranked number one in the world in the 35 and over class by the United States Tennis Association. And I just wish all 350 of my old players of the past 30 years could come by and I could say to them what I'm saying about Joaquin, thanks for your dedication, thanks for your desire, and thanks for your ability to be a leader on the team, and thanks most of all to, for your loyalty to the school and to the coach. Ladies and gentlemen, entering the University of Miami Sports Hall of Fame, Joaquin Rasgado.